Welcome dear students to my channel Biology with Dr. Isharani. Today we are going to discuss the most beautiful creation which is flower. You can see that here is a bunch of beautiful flower. Flower is defined as a modified or compressed shoot. A typical flower having these four parts, calyx, corolla, androsium and gynesium. So students, let's practically demonstrate the typical flower. Dear students, here is a typical flower. What is flower? Flower is defined as the modified or compressed shoot. You can see there is here is a shoot and it is again terminate into a flower. So flower is a modified or compressed shoot. A typical flower having four parts or four rails. The first one rail, the single one is known as sepal. These are the green in color and the single one is known as, yeah, individual known as sepal and the group is known as calyx. And this group is indicated with the symbol K. After that, you will see the second rail which is colorful. The individual one is known as petal and they are numerous in number and the collectively or collection or group of petal is known as corolla. And it will indicate with a symbol C, capital C. After that, you can see here is a third rail which is individual known as stamen. You will see the shape of stamen is like this. Here is the stamen, the anther and the flamen. And these are numerous in number. The single one is known as stamen and the group is known as androsium. And it will indicate with the symbol A. After that, you will see the innermost part which is the individual known as carpel and the group is known as gynesium. The fourth rail is known as carpel. The group of or collection of carpel is known as gynesium. You will see that a carpel is the female part and it will symbolize with the capital G and it contain stigma, style and ovary. When we open or cut this flower in section, the innermost part we will see the ovary and the outermost, the uppermost is known as stigma. Then here is a thin neck-like structure known as style. So a typical flower which contain all these four parts is known as complete or regular flower. And also the flower which contain male and female both part in same flower is known as hermaphrodite. If the flower have one part either carpel or either stamen then this flower will be the incomplete or irregular flower and that flower which contain stamen known as staminoid, staminate flower and carpelate flower. So these are the typical parts of flower. Again a brief description of flower that you will learn these parts and stamen and carpel. You can see the parts of the carpels and the parts of the stamen. Here I have a worksheet for you for the feedback that you have learned the typical parts of flower. For more videos, subscribe my channel. Thank you so much.